I'm gonna get probed. <laughs> hey everybody, my name is Lucky and welcome back. Today we're playing The Graveyard Experience. Um, I thought this was like an obby game, like not an obby game. I mean like work at a pizza place kind of game, but just like with a dark twist, but it turns out it's an actual story. I purposely avoided looking at any other things. I was just told to play it, that it's not what you think or some crap like that. Also, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. It really helps it a lot. After the incident at Sad Burger, you decided to find a new quieter job at a graveyard. You quickly discover that it is not what you thought. All right, let's get into that. Current objective, pick up trash in the building. Pick up, pick up, pick up. This is weird. Like I said, I love these type of games where you're like doing like a night shift somewhere. Cause it's creepy, it's like real. It doesn't feel like too like, oh no, I'm stuck in a dungeon and I have to find my way out. No, it's like, this is a job and scary stuff can happen when you're alone at a job. And if you guys have any experiences work, working like at night and something scary happens, please leave it in the comments below. I love reading those type of things. Okay. Oh. Is your refrigerator running? Yes. Prank callers at this hour? Well, what action? I wonder what accent I should give myself. I feel like I'm in Georgia. This looks like a southern church, so I'm going to say, um, I'm from Georgia. Get a shovel from the shed and dig graves at marked locations. What? At this time of night? Hello? What the freak was that? What in the world was that? The shovel battery is gonna get these from the light? No. Also, what was that sound? Hello? I have a gun. This is very creepy, you guys. Hello? Here, lot. Oh. Oh my god. I'm digging a graveyard for myself. I do not like this at all. Oh my god, just dig it. Just dig the hole. Dang, this one's deeper than the rest. Get a mop and clean the bathroom. I feel like the character that I have, like for the narrator of any game, should have its own like name. Like when I read the instructions or something. I don't know if, you, if this might be like too old for you, I don't know, but. <laughs> Not that I'm that old. <laughs> um, there is, used to be a show called Tales from the Crypt that um, it's like a show that would tell short stories in like multiple short stories per episode. Like I think like the ma the maximum would be three sh stories per episode. And there was a character. Oh my gosh, what was his name? I'm blanking on his name right now. I'll probably put it up somewhere, but. He is basically a dead corpse that is narrating the story, so I want to give him my character a name. So I'm going to give my character a name. Oh my god, I'm stupid. It's over here. Okay, so three. Okay. Since I'm only playing horror games now, it's kind of like, might as well. Okay, current kind of objective. <laughs> I must be seeing things. Oh, it's aliens. It's aliens. Yes. Yes. I love aliens. Place flowers at marked location. Okay. Oh, no. It's so creepy. It's so creepy. Yeah, especially after the freaking alien freaking incident is that happened. Where was it in Texas? I can't remember right now. I don't have flowers. I didn't get flowers. Oh. Oh, more? Okay. Oh. Oh my god. And 
answer the phone. Oh my gosh, this is horrifying. Could that mean? Where? How do they even know that I'm even? Someone's even here. Hello. Oh my God. Sir, please call during normal business hours. Answer the phone. A power outage. Turn the power back on behind the house. Great. Okay, so if if there's someone out there, oh my god, is that creepy? I can't even come up with anything. I'm actually like creeped out. What's that? What is that? That's the Xbox sound. Investigate the strange sound. <laughs> what? 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 Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm not gonna make it. 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 Clean trash off graves? You want me to go back out there? Did you not see what I just saw? Can I have a weapon or something? Else? That was the Xbox sound. Like the first original Xbox, by the way. <laughs> it's weird because that triggered memories because growing up, I was like, you could hear people talking in the Xbox sound. Like it was obvious. Like it was well known that the sounds were supposed to be like aliens because the Xbox was like high tech or something when it came out. Please flashlight. Oh no, that means I have no, no, no flashlight. I don't know if this has any like mul like multiple endings. Let's just try to do our best. Any batteries acquired? Oh my god, I heard something coming up. Leave with Agent Adams or stay. What? I just came to work. Why is this happening to me? I thought that thing, swivel thing, squirrely thing was the freaking creature. He, the alien forgot his little radio. Agent Adams, the men in black. That's what he's white, bald head. Continue, oh, continue story. Oh, ending, go with agent. Oh. Ooh. So that is the ending for that, but I kind of want to see what happens. So I'm going to stay at Graveyard. All right, get off my property before I shoot you. Answer the phone. I feel like I'm about to get jump scared before I even get to the phone. Yeah, who would be calling him? Agent Adams was the the person to call, right? Behind me. They're looking for you. Don't go outside. Tell the agent to leave. What? This is confusing. I'm assuming like I'm about to get really jump scared. So. See what happens.
Ending number three. The events that acquired tonight were quickly covered up and classified. You quit the graveyard shortly after. The graveyard experience. What the heck was that? So, that's ending three. I'm so curious what was supposed to happen. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna, I'm curious about something. Okay, we're at the point where it's leave with Agent Adams or stay. So we're gonna choose leave. This is ending, so. Ending number one, okay. Where am I? Agent Adams. Thank you for coming with us. Unfortunately, for what you saw, we're gonna need to erase your memories. Just look your account. Can I move? Wait, what? And in one, your mind was erased along with any memories of tonight's events. You return to the graveyard with no further incidents. Okay, so so far we've had objectives, I mean endings one and three, so we're missing two. So I'm assuming it's uh, the it's what happens with whatever when the alien actually gets you. So I'm assuming the second ending is when you actually let the alien take you. So basically, you have to just not go into the funeral home. Where does he come from actually? Okay, here we go. Yeah! Ending 2. Okay. Oh, where, where am I? I, I can't move. So they abducted me. <gasps> oh, that is horrifying. I'm gonna get probed. <laughs> you were reported missing by your boss, but were never found. I shouldn't have said that. So that was a bad idea. I think the only good thing is, is the one where you don't get your brain fried from, from the agent and the one where you don't get abducted so it's ending two i feel like it's like the best one which is you quitting the graveyard and keeping the experience that you know aliens exist but it's like because the other ones you forget a portion of your life <laughs> or you get abducted and don't have a life anymore but um i hope you enjoyed it and if you haven't subscribed please consider subscribing it really helps out a lot and until next time i wish you luck